Thank you so much for watching Tomochi the Music. As you see, I don't really show so much technical stuff usually, but um, some of the fingering exercise I used to do, and uh, as you see, like one, two, one, two, three, four, one, two, though, you know, um, I show you that later too. But this one called Crazy Chromatic, okay. So basically, bottom notes are based on a chromatic, top notes move a different way, so that can really work on a coordination. And I show you three different levels, and you can go more if you want to. All right. So the first one, you can play around the fifth fret. Okay. So bottom notes really going, you know, one, two, three, four. But top note, three, four, one, two. Okay. So bottom notes, one, two, three, four. Top note, three, four, one, two. And together like this. One and the third finger. Okay. One, three. Next one, two, four. Almost like a chromatic power chord. Okay. Fifth. Next one, three and one, three and one. Okay. Minor third. And then four and two. See? So let's repeat like this. Slowly. One more time. So yeah, I, I use like this, pick and finger. Second finger. Well, third finger. Yes? Wait a minute. Third finger. Now, wait a minute. This is the thumb. This is the first finger. So second finger. Sorry about that. Like that. So one more time. One, three. Finger is one, three. Two, four. Three, one. Four, two. Okay, you got the idea? Then you go up next set, so you know, from fifth string. Wait a minute. Here, I found the paper. Just uh, copy this. It's a free, because the internet is free. Everything free, you see everything free. Nice world, nice. Anyway. Oh yeah, 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 I found the other one. So this is, um, you know, we do chromatic. One, two, one, two. Okay, one, two, one, two. Copy this one. Yeah, here you go, it's free. That's all free stuff. Nice. So you learn that, the first, first step you go, slowly, sustain. Hard to do. And then sound is important. I'm using Music Master Bass Amp today using a Providence Cable E205TF. Really, really nice. And I'm using nice Ibanez guitar. I mean, this has a lot of function, but you know, sounds so good, even chromatic scale, you see. Slowly like that. I'm just showing this guitar is so balanced nicely, you know. Like, yeah, so okay, so you go ascending. Now next one, the tricky part is so two notes and bottom notes you know lower notes. Like that, and then top note one, two, four, two, one, two, four, three. Sorry, so ended up four, two, three, one. So that sounds two, four, one, three. You see that paper that I show you. easy to do two staccato so make sure you go slowly right? you got that 
That's it. Then maybe you go half step up. I have only a practice one, so a little bit uh, not smooth, but it's hard. Maybe go up to, you know, three. Fifth fret, sixth fret, seventh fret. That's enough. So level two. Why not play individually? So now, now almost like a funny sound. I'm not really good at play fast, but you can. If you want to play fast, you can practice that too. Okay, so so now one three, two four, one three one, four two. Now, now you're doing only the picking. So now you have to use palm muting, uh, right hand palm muting and the bottom notes. Not, not the palm muting like that. So like when you go to fifth string, your, your, your hand go lower. That's why I don't use uh, anka on pinky or any hands on the bridge because this way I have more room. I mean more uh, like a room to uh, control the uh, muting. It's kind of hard to do. So slowly, now difficult part is now backwards, you have to go 4-3, 3-1. Two, four, one, three. One more time. Four, two, three, one, two, four, one, three. So you go. So there's a level two. <laughs> I used to practice this one a lot, but I don't really practice lately, so I have to practice too. That's why I pull off this one. <laughs> okay. And then I used to do a little crazy too. The level three, start skipping. So the first one, you go, you see like a, you know, string next to each other. So that's harder because you are like that. So this one, you have to be careful because you strain a little bit your uh, muscle because you have to do a lot of stretch and your finger is not used to play this you know shapes or uh, moves and definitely little stressful to your fingers and more you practice you can get better but beginning you don't want to practice too much because you hurt your hand so anytime you feel a little pain, stop. Not worth to play because you're going to hurt your hand. So you don't want to do that. So this one, I would do like, you know, this for a few days. Maybe later you try slowly. But this is more like muting technique. play it really well so don't worry about that so yeah that's it okay so you have 
two notes. Going down, you know, up and down. Then you do individual notes. In the third level, you skip one string. And I'm sure somebody wanna do more like a skipping, but I'm not really into that much about physical exercise too extreme. I just wanna do basically smooth and no noise. That's what I'm looking for. So that's it. Okay, so pretty simple, right? Make sure I copy that part. And yes, thank you so much for watching Tomohushi the Music. If you like my content, please hit the like button and consider subscribing my channel. And of course, I encourage you to share my video with your friends too. That'd be nice. Okay, so this is like entire internet system is really funny. If you post something, not really go to everybody. You see this one too. I am keep working on it. So gradually, I think um, something will change. I hope more people will see my lesson video to understand how to practice proper way and then enjoy guitar playing more and more. That's what I'm really looking forward to. All right, so um, if you hit the bell notification, that will alert you to all my new content. So this will help me to create, creating a lot more fun contents for you in the future. Okay, so thank you so much. Have a great day.